Hi guys, today we're going to be looking at their second episode in the PV Poke series. It's going to be called Psycho Cut B Umbreon. Now, over here, we're going to test out something first. This this episode is going to be kind of long for one of these episodes, so sit back and relax and get a snack. So, um, over here, we're testing something, and basically, the difficulty is novice, and it's Go Battle League Master. So the max CP for Agron is 3,000. The max CP for Magikarp is 274. And as you see right here, Magikarp has lock on. And Agron double resists it. As you can see right here, it double resists it. 0.39, right? And then, um, so it double resists it. And so in this video, it's also a feature of how thick Umbreon is. And then we're gonna be just timing this thing. So um, we're gonna click battle. And three, two, one, go. Okay, we started the timer. And now we're just gonna be looking at Agron stats since this is gonna take a little while. Um, so its lead is 60, closer 64, switch is 38, charger 61, attacker is 64, consistency is 92. And it's 110 in the Master League, 67 score. Key matchups are Dragonite, Togekiss, Gyarados, Z Shadow Zapdos, and Shadow Dragonite. Top counters are Lucario, Steelix, Melmetal, Stunfisk, Galarian, S and Excadrill. Um, and it's going to be weak to fighting and ground. They're both double super effective, so you got to watch out for that. Fast moves are Smackdown, uh, Dragon Tail, and Iron Tail. Charge moves are Heavy Slam, Stone Edge, and Thunder. Primary type is steel, secondary type is rock. Weaknesses are fighting ground. Oh yeah, I forgot water. Resistances are poison, normal, flying, rock, psychic, ice, fairy, dragon, and bug. We're gonna be going back here. And Agron's tanking it um a lot. Only about half of it. And we're gonna be looking at more of its stats here. So its attack is 157 and 168. Defense is 203 to uh, two, 215 stamina is 135 to 147. And the rank 1, I, I just don't know what that means, but I know like this has to do with the IVs. Like it's level 40, 15, 15, 15. And then we're just going to be going back. And since it's red health right now, um, we're just going to wait. And we're going to get ready to stop the timer here. Um, this is kind of boring. Um, it's almost done. And so one minute, 51 seconds. Okay, not too bad. Now we're just going to be going out of this and on to the next one. Remember this one minute, 51 seconds. And then we're just going to reset this. So Umbreon with Snarl uh, and Magikarp, we got to add like a dark eye or something over here. So this Magikarp has lock on. And remember, Umbreon... Um, it takes neutral damage from lock on. So basically it will be doing neutral damage and Agron double resists and at the end you'll see just how tanky Umbreon is cuz like you you'll just see it may not take as long um as the Agron but it doesn't even resist it and look it's 2137 CP compared to the Agron which was 3000 CP. So we're going to battle. Three, two, one, go. Okay, so we started the timer. We're going to be looking at Umbreon stats in the Master League. So its lead is 48. Closer is 52. Switch is 38. It's kind of trash. Charger is 54. Attacker is 47. Consistency is 99. And it's 172 with a score of 57. Key matchups are Giratina Origin, Mewtwo, Armored Mewtwo, Latios and Executor Shadow. Top counters are Scrafty, Shadow Gardevoir, Togekiss, Kong Keldor, and Obstagoon climbing those ranks. Fast moves are Snarl and Faint Attack. You definitely want Snarl. Charge moves are Foul Play, Dark Pulse, and Last Resort. Primary type is Dark. Um, weaknesses are Bug, Fairy, and Fighting. Resistances are Psychic, Ghost, and Dark. And over here, um, it only single resists Psychic, but Pokemon Go just makes it that way because, like, they just want to do that to keep the flow and balance. 
and then we're gonna be going back here um to the umbreon and it's not even half health it's not even half health my gosh um yeah i don't know this is the agron um and like pokemon go just makes it that way because they wanted to know like it really resists like for example ground type pokemon um they only they they only res they resist electric um by 0.39 because pokemon go just wants to make it that way because um the only thing super effective against electric is ground and then and they just want to keep the flow that way and yeah attack is 100 to 111 defense is 190 to 201 stamina is 170 to 182 and it's level 40 what 15 15 15 and it, it i was just rushing there and it's i don't even care it's it's still one fourth health like it, it, that's how tanky it is i like how how tanky can you get and um uh, I think that I remember the Agron being 1 minute 53. Comment down below if I'm wrong. Because I think it was 153. And then we're just going to see the lock-ons do damage from here. So, going to be taking down the Umbreon. And we are going to stop it. Now, 2 minutes 30 second, 2 minutes 31 seconds. Like, that's so thick. How, how thick can you get? Like, Agron was 3,000 CP. Umbreon doesn't even resist it. And, yeah. And now, for the final countdown, countdown this Magikarp has Psycho Cut. So that's going to be doing absolutely no damage to the Umbreon. And, yeah. Umbreon's going to tank its way throughout the battle. Okay. 3, 2, 1, go. Okay, so this is going to be really, really boring. Right now, we're just going to be looking at some stats for the Mask of Geek, if you want to get ready for that. So, number one is Giratina Altered. Number two is Zekrom. They're doing some, um, PV Poke is really cool because they do, like, some mathematical prediction and, um, think that Zekrom's going to be number two. Then three is Groudon with the Mudshot and the Legacy, Fire Punch and Earthquake. Um, four is Mewtwo with Psy Strike and sh sh Psycho Cut, Psy Strike, and Shadow Ball, Double Legacy Mewtwo. Fifth is Giratina Origin. T sixth is Togekiss. Seventh is Dialga. Eighth is Garchomp. Nine is Melmetal. Tenth is Landorus Incarnate. And I have a maxed out Landorus. So if I just had Earth Power, that would be pretty good. Um, you can see it in my Mask of the Battle. Because I have Mudshot and Outrage. So yeah. Then Dragonite Reshiram is 12th then palkia um dragonite shadow we're just gonna search up kiram for fun i don't know how to spell it kiram but let's just see no i don't think it's there okay right now then shadow swampert or no just um then uh where was i um metagross snorlax mew shadow raikou Lugia, Swampert, Kyogre, Raikou, Swampert Shadow, Regirock, La Latios, Shadow Gardevoir, Mamoswine, Zapdos. I have all these Pokemon, the but my enemy is two attacks. Now we're just going to be going here. Bruh. How? It's just tanking it. Like, how? It's just, like, tanking it. thought it was going to be, like, I, I don't know. Okay, so then... Uh, Snorlax, Shadow Magnezone, Rhyperior, Conkeldor, Gyarados, Shadow Gyarados, Regiice, Glaceon, Machamp, Articuno Shadow, Articuno, Heatran, Metagross Shadow. And as you see, ratings in the Master League are not too high. Like, for example, I go to the 30, 43rd one, and it's only 80. Because in the Master League, you have to use the same Pokemon. Like, you can just be testing out new Pokemon like um, uh, Stun Galarian Stunfisk. That, you're, they're not going to get wins. You have to do the same Pokemon. And Slacking is just a flex. I mean, what 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 is that? Huh? Huh? What? Slowking is better. Slow. Slowbro is even better, too. 
Now we're going to be going here. And I'm Rion, just got to half health. You do the math. Just, you do the math. That's, that's OP. That was just OP. Okay. So, we're going to be going down again. And, um, there's Heracross, Shadow Zapdos, Magnus Zone, Darkrai, Hydrogen. I really want to get one of those. Mewtwo Armor. I have a Haxorus. I mean, an Axew, which is way different. But, like, um, I don't have any candy. Um, even though I got 32 candy from hatching it from a 10k. Then Jirachi, Escavalier, Virizion, Moltres, Shadow Moltres. Tyranitar, Shadow, Genesect, climbing its way to the top. Hariyama, Tyranitar, Thunderous, Incarnate, Registeel, Obstagoons. Wow, good and all. Um, good and all. Uh, leaks. <laughs> and now we're just gonna be going in the Great League looking for Galarian Pokemon. Hopefully, if I search up Galar. No. But Pokemon Go made this new update where if you, for example, you search up Kanto, it will show all the Kanto Pokemon. So Stunfist Galarian is third. And then Obstagoon, number 32, pretty good. Then, um, I don't know what's the evolution of Darumaka. I don't, like, I, I just don't know. Um, what else? I, I, well, I forgot all the other Galarian Pokemon, honestly. Okay, Umbreon Red Health. This is so boring. Oh my gosh. We're going to be going back to the Great League. And I want to get a Scrafty. I, want to, I really want to get a Scrafty because it's so good. My team would probably be like Scrafty, Meganium, and like, I don't know, Vigorot Safe Switch. Even though that's not going to have much coverage because there's two Pokemon with counter. It's so like, still. Um, gotta quickly do it. Okay, so we're just going to see it from here because I don't want to take any risks of too, making it too low. So Umbreon still tanking its way to the top. And it is going to serve... Like, this, 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 is, this is just boring. 5 minutes, 20 seconds, 69 milliseconds. I mean, uh, cent to seconds because milliseconds is a thousandth of a second. Um, and yeah, so Agron was 1 minute 53, um, for lock-on. Then, for lock-on for Umbreon, it was 2 minutes and, like, 13 seconds, I think. And then over here, it's 5 minutes 21 seconds. That's pretty surprising. And this just shows how tanky Umbreon is. And this was a pretty long video. But, see y'all in the next clip. Or we'll be given the clue.